Joining me on Mobile World Live today is Michael Shashny, who's from global connectivity provider Bix. Michael, great to see you. Hello, Justin. Great to see you as well. To start with, Michael, um, tell us about some of the big trends that you're seeing in the wholesale space. Well, I would say the biggest trend we are seeing is definitely the emergence of new needs across the world sales space in general. So those new needs are driven by the global shift toward digitalization, collaboration, cloud, all of which have been accelerated by the COVID as people were suddenly forced to work from home, uh, companies had to provide immediate solutions for virtual meetings, secure communication, electronic payments, and so on. So there is definitely, I mean, a, a, a big shift in digitalization, and I mean, we, we are part of that. Now, there is also a trend of optimization in the core services, which are enabling this digitalization. And there, I mean, we are looking at uh, opti operational efficiencies with managed services, outsourcing, and also ultimately consolidation. And then, uh, finally, there is also an increase in active collaboration within the industry. So, especially with, uh, with fraud and security, uh, people have to, to collaborate even more and prevent uh, the networks from being attacked and subscribers also from uh, having uh, damages. So you've outlined some of the trends there, Michael. Um, how do they, they then translate into opportunities? I mean, what are some of the biggest growth opportunities that you're seeing for operators over the next year or so? So operators, they have the opportunity to drive growth by capitalizing on the digitalization. So they can diversify themselves into uh, IoT and into cloud, which holds a lot of potential for them. So uh, we, we do expect a, a lot of growth in, in data, uh, digital voice, messaging, uh, supporting application to person, audio and video conferencing, and also the use of cloud-based application. And everything will be further accelerated uh, with the rollout of 5G and IoT worldwide. And then we also see uh, growth in, in roaming, which was, of course, impacted by all the travel bans uh, to, to spread, I mean, to, to avoid the spread of the, the virus, of course. So uh, before the, vi the, the virus uh, came, we had a, a continuous growth of roaming, especially on the data side, which was growing 100% year over year. So we expect now to be back to growth as all the travel uh, limitation will be lifted. So we, we are all very eager to travel uh, after having spent uh, more than a year at home. So, so there will be a lot of demand for roaming services and operators have to, to be ready for it. And then also, uh, finally, there will be the acceleration of 5G and IoT, which uh, is a massive potential uh, and uh, an operator can definitely tap in it and, uh, and enable the, the, the next shift of uh, digitalization and uh, industry transformation. Many of the markets you just highlighted, Michael, are sectors where BIX plays. Um, so tell us, what is BIX doing to really help operators capitalize on these opportunities? So overall, BIX is uh, acting as a bridge on one side between the internet players, the cloud, uh, the enterprises, and on the other side also the mobile operators. So we, we can help operators to definitely tap into all those opportunities uh, linked to digital uh, transformation. So for instance, in terms of cloud communication, uh, we can help operators uh, provide uh, services uh, such as the connectivity to public cloud, uh, virtual phone numbers, programmable communication, and also messaging A to P. Uh, we can also help operators to optimize uh, their core services. So with managed services, we can help them increase operational efficiency and also maximize the profitability, which is very key. So we have also developed advanced analytic solution to provide them with key network insight which can help them to enhance the quality of service, to identify also key business opportunities, and overall make faster business decisions. And then also, lastly, we, we are also here to accompany operators on their journey to accelerate global 5G and IoT. 
And this is thanks to our signaling and IPX services, as well as our SIM for SYNC services. So overall, uh, we can help them addressing all the interoperability, compatibility challenges that are linked to the, the rising diversity of devices, network, use cases, and business models. And looking forward, when we come out of the pandemic, Michael, hopefully in the near future, um, what would be your advice to operators? What, what can operators best do to really safeguard their revenue streams, uh, to prevent churn, and of course, to monetize their offerings? Well, uh, for sure, there are lots of uh, things they can do. Uh, I would say the, the very first uh, item would be to definitely uh, look at fraud and security. Uh, they must remain vigilant on the constant threat that exists on the network. So they need to invest in through uh, pro additional protection to safeguard the revenues and also, even more importantly, their subscriber. So we see that the, the ecosystem is becoming more and more complex. So, so the methods also adopted by the, the fraudster. So implementing advanced security solution on voice, SMS, signaling, and IPX is definitely key. Then they can also look to improve the customer experience, and their 5G can be super helpful uh, to, to achieve it uh, because there will be a huge increase in, uh, in the data and the demand from their customer to, uh, to have really the highest quality ultra low latency and also greater reach to cloud based application. So basically, they will need to further invest into all the network and services to meet those expectations and deliver overall a greater customer experience. And for sure, 5G provides the best platform to meet data hungry subscribers and provide them with seamless connectivity uh, while also opening up brand new revenue streams and also new use cases with the rise of IoT. And then also, uh, lastly, well operator, they can get ready to welcome back roamers, uh, either on their network or anywhere in the world, and provide them with the greatest reach and, of course, the highest quality possible. Yes, we're all looking forward to welcoming back Romas and uh, being able to travel again, Michael. Thank you very much for your insights on some broad industry themes. Thank you for joining us. Thanks. Thank you, Justin, for that. Bye-bye.